former nesting area. They still may add. I'm gonna pull down all that kind of excess there and then treat the inside just to keep them away. But once your nest is knocked down in the core with all the larvas taken out, it's usually a done deal. And for your viewing pleasure, this is the core of the nest. So bald-faced hornets build an enclosed nest around this. This is a lot of times what you'll see in trees. I am holding it upside down, but I wanted to give you guys a good look at the squirming larva. So the ones that are already closed have uh, fully formed, or most likely have fully formed bald-faced hornets in there. Um, and then there's the squirmy bald-faced hornet larva. Uh, so wasps are very beneficial environmentally. Um, I, I do feel bad taking them out. Sorry guys. However, uh, like I said before, these guys are extremely aggressive and in is definitely woo, is definitely a danger to the family that lives here. Uh, they have a bunch of small kids. They're running by, uh, you know, especially the later in the season it gets to get more aggressive. They would have a bigger chance to actually get stung and depending on your level of allergy or even if you don't have an allergy these guys will sting multiple times and as you can see they will swarm um, I've actually been chased pretty far <laughs> um, and by chased I mean I'll slowly walk away while wearing a suit because I don't like to rile them up but I can go about a hundred sometimes up to 200 feet and they'll still follow so even if you aren't allergic to uh, wasps these guys will pack a punch and it can be pretty dangerous so sorry little squirmy larva sorry adult wasps but uh for the safety of the people that live here you're going down <laughs> see you guys later